yo, I'd love to go for dinner, but I'm just letting you know ahead of time, I'm not gay. And he looked at me all blushing and up and down with his really serious, enthusiastic slash preacher-like face and said, you are, you just don't know it yet. I was like, damn, that's deep. There's the saying, right? Small minds talk about people, mediocre minds talk about events, and great minds talk about ideas. I'm not trying to be great, I just always talk about ideas. It drives me fucking nuts. Uh, then they were like, oh, you've just been upgraded to featured extra. They did a little chat and they came back to me. They're like, you've been just been upgraded to the main actor. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, what's going on here? We get to be ourselves. Simple as that. I don't believe in I have to wear a shirt with a collar and then I'm taken as a more serious teacher or my wisdom is more sharp. There's no such thing. Thanks, haters and naysayers who made me believe that at the start of my career. Thank you for wasting three years of mine. So I'm happy. If you're not happy, too bad. Start your own company and do what you want to do with it. <laughs> Don't tell me what to do. Good morning everybody, this is Zephyr Kambata reporting to you live. Obviously this is not live because it's pre-recorded. Sometimes I think I'm a dumbass. Anyway, um, this channel, Zephyr Kambata, I've decided it, I've decided it, hilarious. I've decided to, <laughs> I've decided to keep it casual and about me living life because I realized there's too many sides to me. For those of you who are here for the first time, Thank you for being here. Uh, no, this is not some rich ass mansion. Uh, no, I'm not a multi-billionaire. It's just a condo with a nice pool. So I decided to shoot here. Basically, we're renting this place right now. So um, for those of you who are here for the first time, I'm a musician, an actor, a priest, a spiritual card reader and counselor, a Reiki healer, um, a body transformation coach, a personal trainer, certified. Uh, I came up through Singapore's top schools uh, on merit. Well, but not on interest actually, they asked me because I think my parents forced me to study way too much. <laughs> if I had my interests, I'd just be doing this, you know, by the water, uh, swimming, doing yoga, that kind of thing. So anyway, um, apparently people tell me I'm funny. Uh, I'm not trying to be funny, I'm trying to be serious most of the time. But they tell me uh, the humorous side of me can't be uh, prevented. <laughs> so I decided to move all my coaching. For those of you who are here looking for wisdom, if you're here from one of my blogs or quotes, I have that side of me as well. That's on my other channel, Three Part Human. So I've linked those playlists on this channel. If you just click to this channel, which is my name under the video, and you scroll down, you should see those playlists there under Three Part Human. And so we proceed. That was a call from the Singapore Heart Foundation because I've been donating cash to them. And uh, I changed my card. So they want an update on the new card so they can get money. Okay, so as I was saying, I've put all that stuff on Three Part Human. So this channel is more about life and about how I live life because there's just this part of me that I just can't deny. I am obviously a very lifestyle-based person. Not all that crap you see on TV I mean, I shouldn't say crap, because I, mean, I imagine that's very interesting to some people. But, um, you know, not like, um, oh, I drive around in a Porsche and then I stop over for Jaeger bombs and then I hop over to the next bar and then I sleep with eight different women and then uh, I call myself, never mind, I shouldn't say the name. But uh, no, so that's not my life. Uh, but what I do like is comfort, just being myself. And I think a lot of you do and that's what the world is moving towards. So yeah, that's what I do. Uh, I did drop out of the best university in Singapore. Uh, not that Singapore has that many universities to begin with, but you know, it's Singapore. And uh, they're pretty systematic the way they do things. And so I dropped out of the national university to go pursue music. And if that doesn't talk about lifestyle, I don't know what does. Because the engineering faculty, no offense to them, they, they're great, I'm sure, at what they do at engineering. But I just wasn't interested in that. And so I had a chat with the dean and he's like, well, maybe if I give you like time off for four months and then you come back. I was like, no, I, I, it's, I, can't, I can't stay here because everyone I asked, I was like, hey, do you want to go grab a coffee? They were like, um, it's 
wait for the helicopter. Do you want to go grab a coffee, guys? They were like, uh, no, dude, we got to study. And I was like, I was like, one coffee takes 15 minutes. You don't have 15 minutes? They were like, no, we got to study. I was like, wow, that's way too hard ass, even for me. And people told me I was a hard ass. And I realized quickly I'm not. I'm really a softie. Most people don't know this about me, but uh, yeah, I can be a pretty lazy bum. So this channel, I'm gonna leave it for lifestyle. So let's talk about life. So people have been asking me recently, like, hey, if you're so jovial and you're so like casual and funny on one hand, you know, how can you like actually be a life coach, sell courses and, you know, teach and inspire the youth like you do with your other channel, Three Part Human, right? How do you know that Jesus didn't intend for your learning to be humorous? You know? How do you know that? Because any form of teaching I believe and any form of instruction that improves others is really just divine energy coming through that teacher. Whether that's me or anyone else you learn from. Maybe you're a teacher, maybe you're teaching as well. That's just divine energy flowing through all of us. We get to be ourselves. Simple as that. I don't believe in I have to wear a shirt with a collar and then I'm taken as a more serious teacher or my wisdom is more sharp. There's no such thing. Sometimes, you know, wisdom comes in the strangest places. When you're having a drink on a beach or you're sitting down like this with trees on either side of you and a pool behind you, okay. So, um, and so here's a cup of coffee. I'm trying to cut it out. You can follow my health journey on my channel, Three Part Human. So for those of you uh, coffee sponsors and coffee brands, I hope you're listening. Uh, yeah, we can. We can do some coffee stuff for the future. I did one before for Owl Coffee in Singapore. That was a random shoot where I showed up as an extra because I just finished arts college and I was like, okay, let's get into the, you know, the arts world and do some shoots. The director said, uh, oh, you, we need some featured extras now. Then they walked around. Then they were like, oh, you've just been upgraded to featured extra. They did a little chat and they came back to me. They're like, you've been just been upgraded to the main actor. I was like, what the fuck? Like, what's going on here? They were like, oh, relax, you don't have to say anything. We just want to take the, your side face drinking coffee. Do you have a nice side face? Do I? I don't know. It's shapely or something. I, I don't know. I mean, I've always had this face, so to me, it's just my face. But obviously, directors have a better eye for what's working for them and what isn't, right? Thanks for tuning in. On this channel, you'll also find me shopping for my motorbike. That's the recent vlog coming up. Because uh, a motorbike is just freedom, you know, you're in like Not to sound poetic or anything, but you're in divine flow. I mean Nothing on your left side nothing on your right side. It's just you and the road and the skies ahead No constriction like no walls in front of you when you're driving. That's just Well, that's a car <laughs> It's not any adjective, but um, yeah as I pursue my life in mind body spirit in music as I make more music I'm still deciding, my old music is on this channel, but my new music, oh, because I've been practicing singing, I can actually sing now. I mean, I had one of the best guitarists in Singapore tell me, dude, you can sing, please release this song. I was like, okay, okay. I didn't, I didn't know I could sing. Thanks, haters and naysayers who made me believe that at the start of my career. Thank you for wasting three years of mine. We do have three-part human records. So we might want to sign other acts down the line and as our three-part human channel grows and more and more people get in tune with that message I imagine more artists will want to release under us as well just for the exposure and just for a good vibe, you know So I might be putting the music under that channel. Let's see. Um, life is a game I've decided to stop going nuts about branding and getting so crazy The point is if you do good work uh, Your work speaks for itself. Nah, bullshit <laughs> You have to market it out uh, but what I was about to say was if you do good work and you market it out people will know you and your work um, um, If that's your goal Regardless of where you put that music out I could put one song out on this YouTube channel one song out on that YouTube channel, right? But if I'm a good singer and I tour the world People on YouTube will find it no matter which channel it's on they may be on a fucking random channel, X, Y, Z, E, A, B, C, D, exclamation mark. And they'll still find it go, this is the best song in the world, this is the best song in the world. We do that all the time, don't we? I do it, certainly. I seek out my music uh, inspirations on YouTube from like 10 years ago, 15 years ago, 20 years ago. And they're often on random channels before all these publishing houses took to YouTube or whatever. So, um, I'm not sure what's in store for me in life uh, other than obviously my own goals and plans uh, which I do know a lot of those will come to fruition because that's just what I do what I say I'll do I write down and then I go do it 
Um, you can, if you've been having a tr trouble with your goals or anything, it's just a side note. You can go to my channel, Three Part Human, and we are having a course coming up on how to achieve any goal in life. Um, so far, all the goals that I've set, I've achieved, and um, yeah, there's a system to do that. Uh, to me, that just sounds boring because I've done it a, quite a few times. Uh, but to you, that might be exciting and new. Um, going like, oh, I want to be the top salesperson at this job. Or I want to be uh, a singer and have a song out by next year. Or I want to be uh, an amazing housewife, loving, caring, comfortable, uh, take care of my kids and husband and uh, cook amazing meals and teach the world how to do the same. Or the same for males, house husband, you know, that's a thing now apparently maybe you'd like to do that right so whatever you might like to do and achieve i have a really good system to achieve these things in fact i did say i would be putting out a lot more vlogs and vlogs one day people would pay me money because i uh put out things of value to other human beings but yeah maybe you're watching this five years later maybe i'm already doing that because that's one of the goals i'm gonna just repeat that coffee brands if you're listening this is uh some pretty pretty good coffee oh t-shirt brands if you're listening uh, that's a pretty good body oh it rhymes coffee and body I just make a joke there but that's one of my goals and that's I guess gonna happen via this YouTube channel so thank you so much for your support for that this channel is more casual I might even be heading out for coffee with different people I don't know what's going on with this virus and this lockdown situation but once it ends that is one of the things I want to do you know wake up have a swim kiss and hug my family make sure they all feel good for the day and then head out into the world and make sure more people feel good you know have coffee with them by then maybe I've given up coffee so maybe tea maybe I've given up tea so maybe water uh, past couple of days my body is doing a real 180 on the coffee thing uh, if you're following my journey on Three Part Human where I talk about health, it's kind of like, you know, your body is going like this and then you have an awakening moment and then it starts to swing like that in between what it's doing because one part of your body is pulling you towards like, I like to use the word ascension because it's flashy. <laughs> but that's not really ascension. Well, it kind of is in a sense because you're developing better habits. Uh, so it pulls you towards ascension and another part of your old habits pull you back to your old comfort zone BS. So it, it kind of flows up and down and then before you you go to the new level, right? So right now I'm in this stage, although this is not my emotions, thank God. I've been over that a few. So this is the, I guess the physical health graph is going like this right now because I'm about to expand to the new stage. The emotions graph, that was some time back when I was in the thick of my spiritual awakening. Luckily, I'm over that. So as I navigate this physical thing, my emotions are super zen and I'm super loving to myself. I say, oh, you want to have coffee today? Okay, Mwah. have coffee. Oh, you only want to have green shakes today? Mwah. Okay, have green shakes. Oh, you want to sleep early to yesterday night? Okay, sleep early. Yesterday night, I slept early for the first time. Midnight. Yeah, midnight's early for me. Uh, as a creative and a hyperactive brain person, who has too many ideas. Uh, I wouldn't use the word too many. I have so many, I would say, because there's no such thing as too many. More ideas is better. Uh, ideas are what uh, shape the future. And there's this saying, right? Small minds talk about people. Mediocre minds talk about events. And great minds talk about ideas. I'm not trying to be great. I just always talk about ideas. It drives me fucking nuts. But it has led to some great things. People have benefited. People have taken my courses some people have taken my coaching uh, some people I've talked through their breakups their divorces because I am a coach you know it's led these ideas of I'll start this I'll start that has led to great things you know even if one human benefited is a world is, is nothing it may not not be much to you but it's a world of difference to them so don't discount your efforts by just benefiting one human it's fantastic and so when people say oh you started this company but you've only done like 25 card readings and 25 spiritual counseling sessions and I'm like yeah and that's 25 lives changed even by a little bit for the better that's a whole new trajectory for someone's life how can you even count the number whether it's 25 million or two it's it's still great I feel great inside so I'm happy if you're not happy too bad start your own company and do what you want to do with it <laughs> don't tell me what to do I have been an actor before 
so you can check out my acting videos on this channel where I've starred in some start <laughs> where I've acted in some commercials also primetime TV channel 5 uh, as a, an actor a supporting actor obviously I didn't know head or tail of what I was doing then other than the face care routine which I researched like a madman and obviously I'd been working out so I looked fit if you need any help as a creative I think I'm more of a helper and a teacher really and a coach that's just kind of like my divine mission anyway if you need help uh, getting into small acting roles like that on the side or even if you're full-time in showbiz or like me you were full-time in music but on the side you were doing acting you know to pay bills or just because you like it to see what it was that's why I entered I didn't enter to pay bills I entered because it's like okay let's see how fun or not fun this thing is if you're doing that check out those commercials and if you like what you see on the channel happy to show you tell you how to do that if you want rigorous training obviously I might put out a course on that but if you just want like an email back and forth I could help you with that and just guide you and point you uh, in the right direction which I a direction which is what I took and then from there you can hopefully um, uh, see if you like it see if acting is your thing I'll talk more about my experiences on the acting uh, set uh, later on so far I hope you've enjoyed this video I got inspired to make it because I slept early woke up early and swam and I'm a Scorpio a water sign if your horoscope is Scorpio or any other water sign you should be spending quite a lot of time near water it'll help you think straight in water even better take a shower take a few don't waste water <laughs> Maybe just hang out at the pool more instead of taking a shower. Yeah, so that's all for today I mean, I love to talk to you guys all day long. I think I'm a talker Which is probably why I should start some shows or a podcast on this. Uh, oh my see that's how the ideas start I'm just gonna convert this audio into a talk show call it the Zephyr show take care have a great day ahead And if you need help with anything, let me know and if you want to be entertained in a different way let me know as well and um check out the video on my channel about me going bike shopping there's some really cool bikes there i wish this wouldn't end but i've got to eat breakfast so thank you take care and hopefully i'll shoot in your country sometime soon because that is the plan to tour and to showcase different things as i explore life maybe you'd like to explore life with me not as my wife oh my god wife and life rhymes obviously i'm already married but uh you know we could explore as friends oh i'm not just talking to the women there i'm talking to the guys too guys often hit on me and one guy actually told me he just stared at me and he's like do you want to go for dinner and i was like yo i'd love to go for dinner but i'm just letting you know ahead of time i'm not gay and he looked at me all blushing and up and down with his really serious enthusiastic slash preacher like face and said you are you just don't know it yet i was like damn that's deep and it kind of makes me think sometimes i'm sure we all have these kinds of thoughts I love you. Bye-bye. Oh, I also had a cute little grasshopper cross my path. I wonder what that means. Maybe I'll cover animal totems and spirit animals on my three-part human channel. Or maybe I won't. I'm not sure why I'm talking in a funny voice. I guess that's my host voice. Cheers.